so the next definition is service now is a itsm tool okay so itsm what is itsm it service management it means information technology service management okay the what does it mean so when you say service right so here we see in a service right so what is the meaning of service what we discussed what is service can someone please tell me anyone Sai Kiran, can you tell me what is service based on your understanding? Sir, uh, servicing is uh, what are the problems coming from the uh, uh, client. We have to resolve that problem by using TKK. Right. So, yes. So, whatever we are getting from uh, client, that is a service. What we give back okay, to customer is a service. Okay. So, when you say now, you said uh, only issues, but not only issues but even request also okay now i asked you to build something that is a request not an issue right so it would be anything whatever the client is looking for and whatever we are providing back to them is service right simple is that clear yes no uh, yes sir okay so now we'll see one second right so now see uh, when you say service now what all the things will be there in service this is what we need to see okay itsm see now do you know anything about development madhivya or uh, sai kiran you know anything about development in degree mm, development in the sense uh, programming we have to do sir okay right madhivya you are going through your you are third year right so in second year you you got uh, java c okay java java uh, Core Java and all right. Object oriented. Yes, yeah. So yes, see, de yeah. development in sense like see, like let's say I I I am a, I am works for a team. Okay, we what we do is we develop applications. Okay, developing applications. Right. So now, what are the things involved in development? First, okay, requirement. Okay, so if I want to develop an application, I want to get the requirement. What is the requirement? Okay, then developers will come and develop the application. And what after development, what it will happen? What is the next step of development? Testing, right? Someone will test it. Okay, and then after testing, what they will do? They will release to production, means they will hand over to customer. Okay, release. Okay, and you develop the application. Okay you want to provide some documentation so here knowledge because these are all new terminologies but these are the development terminologies okay if you just start looking or learning development then you will get it okay so i just listed five here these are these things also belongs to service okay now you develop this application you hand over to client Okay, tomorrow thousand people are using the application. Okay, five people got issue. What they will do? They will raise a issue, right? You are following me, ma? Yes or no? This point is clear, ma? Uh, this point, whatever we discussed so far on this point, is that clear? Shall I explain in a different way? Ah, we understand. Madhivya, is that clear? Yes, sir. So let's say you you develop you move this application to customer. Okay, thousand people are using. Then, okay, some ten people are getting issue. What they will do? They will raise issue. Okay, the we call it as incident. Okay, in in real IT, if it is an issue, okay, it will be called as incident. Okay, so incident I took as incident. So incident management. Okay, then problem. The problem is a little bigger okay then change okay so like this operations so like this okay there would be so many services there would be so many terminologies before requirement now let's say i giving i am giving you work okay the client will ask you how much you will do how much i need to pay so here you will get budgeting right so then how much duration 
okay within four months i need to complete within two months i need to complete here we will get time okay we will call it as sla right so all these things will come when you are providing the application to users or customers when they are giving a project means they all these pages will be involved all these steps will be involved like how divya is doing first year second year third year to complete a degree okay when we are taking a project we need to th these all pages will be there in the project okay i'll show you one diagram okay see here try to understand might see easy only okay just try to understand okay see here there is an image here you can see this image huh? clearly i just made it bigger is that clear this image is clear ma yes sir yeah so see this this entire image will tell you about iutsm okay service management okay when you are saying a service to a customer service not the word service it involved in all these phases okay so it starts from very 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 high level to big client people like our our owner their owner will sit and uh, discuss what is the project okay how much they need to pay financial management okay what is the overall structure so they starts with strategy what is the basic strategy once they are confirmed no, then they will hand over this to some team where they come and do the design part so in order to complete this work how many people we want how much of uh, infrastructure we need to build okay in with how much time sla i said na slm sla how much time we have okay how many resources how many infrastructure okay building cost everything they will design here okay here it is main, mainly they will speak but here they will design this is like a paperwork once that is done then they will come here so they will do the actual project here they will create an application they will test the application they will do the release to the production they also do some change management they also create the knowledge okay so this is not like complete development the transition is like actual work we do right once the work is completed now we move to production then support work so bhuvan was telling na so he supports some application so he supports this one so for supporting means we call it as operations so once then an application is in production okay someone needs to manage it maintain it okay so here it will come okay reporting okay incident management so if the application is not functioning so users will use incident management to report the issue okay so when we see service na service involves all these phases okay so this this is itsm it service management so when we are saying we are providing a service to class customer it means that we are we will be doing any one of the work here from here it could be if you are supporting any client in it form okay means you are involved in any one of the job in this diagram you, no one will do everything okay but maybe a couple of things if i say na i do i will be part of incident management problem management project management change release testing knowledge okay request management and slm so my job my current job involves on this part but still i support the service maybe okay one person came okay he is only supporting incident management he knows incident management he support an application so he knows only incident management so whatever you see okay when you say a service the service is this one and our work will belongs to any one of these pages this is clear ma what is itsm yes sir yeah ma divya is that clear yes, that sir. means uh, sir uh, service strategy is there in that uh, there are three types of service project financial they in the three only one they will provide no ma when the bigger Complete. people are speaking Complete. na they hmm. will uh, talk all these three so what okay. is what exactly we need you we need from you so that is service okay, okay. okay. high level hmm. then how you hmm. take it into a project portfolio like how you divide it how you manage this work into projects this is this one then financial means hmm. how much i need to pay for you correct okay, so yeah 
one by one like there see these these things are very looking here very very smaller but na each okay. one is a bigger pick if you know okay. very the high level service portfolio you will be a big big manager okay if you know slm okay. you, you are a big manager so each one will be having its own uh, uh, definitions and then their work okay, okay. so yes, yeah. okay so so now we learn about itsm right itsm is clear right now this word is clear na yes sir ah ma divya is that clear ma yes sir okay now see once we are clear i will say service now is a itsm tool okay why i can say service now is a itsm tool because okay Yeah. that tool that tool that we are seeing here see here okay incident management so i i i written incident here na so see okay in this system in the tool i can use i can create incident i can manage incident so this tool is supporting incident right and this tool also support problem management okay you can create a problem you can see all the problems okay and the same tool you can also create some knowledge base okay knowledge means knowledge management okay so knowledge just you can create it and it the system same sls okay you can create sls okay so this is one tool where it gives you all these applications okay you can do all the application management in one tool okay all the application is nothing but sm itsm so in this tool you can manage the entire itsm applications that is why service now will call as itsm tool okay so let's say you i give you one project okay right from scratch to end even operations also everything you can capture in one tool the tool is itsm tool this is nothing but our service now tool here is that clear ma why we we see an itsm because of this one so service now is itsm tool so when we say itsm we need to understand what is itsm so in order to understand itsm we need to understand what is a service so we seen service now we know service and then we seen itsm so itsm is also clear then we said service now is itsm tool okay then why what is the meaning of itsm tool and then why service now is itsm tool now we are clear right Yes, sir. Ma, Divya, is that clear, ma? Yes, sir. Understood. Yes, 